So, rumor has it you guys want more of the top neighborhoods in Grand Junction, Colorado. Well, we like to give the people what they want, so stay tuned. Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Robert Hayes. And I'm Christy Hayes. And we are the Hayes Home Group right here in Grand Junction, Colorado. And if you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click that little bell. We're helping people all over the country relocate here to Grand Junction. In fact, yesterday we got a call from someone in the Lone Star State looking to move here to Grand Junction, Colorado. We'll make sure we take care of them with five-star service. By the way, we do have a Texas Roadhouse here in town, so you're good to go. If you are thinking about moving to or living in Grand Junction, Colorado, make sure that you give us a phone call, shoot us a text, send us an email. We got your back when moving to Grand Junction. So Orchard Mesa is an unincorporated part of town. It's right off of Highway 50. Basically, if you keep going, you're going to hit Telluride in about an hour and a half. Behind us is the state-of-the-art brand new middle school that's going to be ready for the kiddos here in about three months. There's also recreation within driving distance all throughout Orchard Mesa. You've got Los Colonias Park. They hold a ton of concerts there. You've got the, the city indoor swimming pool. You've got Okagawa Farms for the freshest produce you could ever imagine. So without further ado, let's kick this thing off and hit out on the top 10 neighborhoods of South Grand Junction. All right, so we're up here in Spyglass. This is a new construction community. It has a great community center, swimming pool, and great walking trails. The views are amazing and the prices start at $350. All right, so we're here in Unaweep Heights. This subdivision has stone accents on most of these gorgeous single family homes. The square footage range is between 1,400 and 3,100 square feet. And the price range here in Unaweep Heights is right in the low to mid $300,000 range. All right, so we're in Granite Springs. This is a gorgeous neighborhood. Square footage is between 1,700 and 2,400. Prices start at 300,000. All of the homes are one story on extra large lots with RV parking. All right, we are in the Country Ridge neighborhood. It's the only neighborhood that's on the south side of Highway 50 in today's top 10. Behind us is the Book Cliffs, so an amazing view here in Country Ridge of the Book Cliff scenery. These homes range anywhere between 1,600 and 2,000 square feet, and a lot of them do have RV parking. The price range on these homes are the high $200,000 range into the low to mid $300,000 range. All right, we're in Mountain View subdivision, which is located in the heart of Orchard Mesa. Square footage ranges between 1,900 and 3,000 square feet. Prices start at 350,000. These are custom built homes with high end finishes and the latest technology. All 
All right, we're here in the Riverview Estates. These homes range anywhere between 1,500 and about 2,300 square feet. Price range is gonna be about 290,000 up to about 340, 350,000. Mostly one story homes. There are a few two story homes in this neighborhood. And look behind me, that is the Grand Mesa. So talk about views, right? So if you're looking for a subdivision with some views, a good price point, and a pretty good square footage range, lots are about a quarter of an acre, so you have a good lot size here as well. All right, we are in Chapita Pines. Chapita Pines Golf Course is the only golf course in Orchard Mesa. Square footage ranges between 1,300 and 2,200 square feet. Prices start at 290,000 and go up from there. Most of the homes in Chapita Pines back up to the golf course. All right, we're in the Chapita Glen subdivision. This subdivision, along with Chapita Pine, basically the bookends of the Chapita Golf Course. So location, location, right? These homes are about 1,800 to 2,500 square feet, and they start in the low $300,000 range and go up to the high $300,000 range. In fact, with the golf course, just mentioning that, this is usually what happens when I go golfing with Christy. Check this out. All right, so we're here in Hawks Nest neighborhood. This is a relatively newer neighborhood, and a lot of these homes are custom homes that have RV access and RV dumps. The square footage here is between 1,400 and 3,100 square feet, and for the most part, you're gonna be in the $300,000 range here in Hawks Nest, and again, you're gonna have the gorgeous views of the Book Cliffs and even of the Grand Mesa off to the east. Welcome to Chapita Estates. This is Orchard Mesa's newest new construction subdivision. Prices start at 450 and it's only a golf cart right away to the golf course. You can get in nine holes before 9 a.m. All right, we're in front of Okagawa Farms. It's green chili time. Whoop, whoop. Alright everybody, thanks for taking a tour with us in the top neighborhoods in the south area of Grand Junction, Colorado. Again, if you are new to this channel, be sure you hit that subscribe button, tap that little bell, that way you're notified every time we post a new video. And if you're looking to move to and relocate here to Grand Junction, Colorado, be sure to give us a phone call, shoot us a text, send us an email, whatever you need to do, we got your back when moving to Grand Junction.